future iPhones could drop charging ports altogether. Here's a little early Christmas present for you. Apple analyst extraordinaire Ming Chi Kuo is out with his latest Apple Opus. Per usual, it's got a lot of fascinating nuggets, this time projecting as far as 2021 in its look at iPhones to come. Let's skip right to that bit, shall we? It seems that 2021 may be the year Apple finally drops the lightning cable. That would, of course, be good news, given that the port is, how to put this nicely, pretty objectively terrible. Apple, of course, already swapped it out on the iPad Pro for the far more ubiquitous and generally better in every way USB-C. What's even more interesting here, however, is the suggestion that it won't be USB-C there to pick up the pace. 9to5Mac notes that the report suggests a 2021 iPhone would provide the completely wireless experience. The implication here being that the charging port drops altogether on the high-end device, like the iPad, it would be more of a gradual sunsetting across the line, starting with the premium model. Maizu, notably, tried something similar this year with a very gimmicky, and pricey, zero. The handset completely dropped ports, speakers and buttons from the equation, as a sort of logical conclusion of broader smartphone trends. For a majority of users, however, I suspect wireless charging is going to have to get some serious speed gains before they're ready to ditch wired charging altogether. Interesting tidbits for 2020 include the arrival of several iPhones, arriving in 5.4, 6.1, X2, and 6.7-inch varieties. All of the above will reportedly sport 5G, with cameras and size being the primary differentiation. The OLED devices will reportedly adopt a similar form factor as the now ancient iPhone 4, per the report. For more on this story, visit the news article link.